I am uh, sorry to have missed video five and the chaos of that involvement pipe. What a racer, am I right? Not to mention Mario in the pipe frame, who I remember left the track so many times in, in the last few lengths. Hey everybody, I'm Brendan, and I'm excited here as we head to group six. Um, I will mention we have a few more open spots still left in the mail-in tournament. Mail yours in. Facebook for races and fun is where you go, and there's where you get your entry number so you know which car to be looking for. Also, that Diecast Racing TV channel that's running that parallel tournament, well, it's still running it, and you best get over there for the extra content. Here we go. First set of four here in group six as we find our sixth finalist for this tournament. Donkey Kong in the sports coupe bounces through the green section and comes out nice and clean. Do we have any more finishers to come off the screen? Yes, we do! And Mario, I believe there in the P-Wing, actually had a lead until he rode the rail and lost all speed, and Cabby will pick up the three points. Only, uh, I believe that's a white Yoshi in the goo. It's good to be back as we head into this new year. Happy New Year to everybody. Indeed, if I've not already said that. Look at Mario spin there. That was at least a 720. As he rolled out and then lost a point. And that point could make an effect later on, especially since usually uh, even the best of racers will DNF at least once over the course of the four heats. On the near side, Cappy and White Yoshi far side. I think that's White Yoshi, maybe a gray. I'm just gonna stick with Yoshi. On the far side, Mario and Donkey Kong. Sports Coupe Donkey Kong, your real speedster in this one. It's hard to imagine any other cars catching up. Mario with the P-Wing, way too many lengths behind to make a difference. Donkey Kong will trip the trap door, and there you go, Mario right in. Sports Coupe to the end. Five more points for Donkey Kong, and we're looking, oh, riding the rail there is Yoshi, and he'll come across. I think we're looking at a possible individual sweep here. It's, it's, very hard in this particular tournament style, but if anyone's going to do it, the speed of Donkey Kong right now is uh, unmatched, honestly, compared to the well, every other car we've seen over the last six videos. Donkey Kong way out in front, and White Yoshi there I, just comes down right onto the rail. I don't know how he even gets his wheels up over the rail. That's half the height of any vehicle we've seen. But he just skips up there and somehow still grinds all the way down to the finish. Donkey Kong on the near side with Cappy. Already a big speed lead for Donkey Kong. A length already, maybe even two as we head into this turn. By far three, four, Cappy. Moving ahead though, trying to keep pace, just can't. Mario with some speed here on the near side and he only has to battle with Yoshi who has no speed coming out of that second turn. Mario will drop Yoshi into the goo. Uh, Donkey Kong as well escaping and he'll get five followed by Okay. Well, I almost said <laughs> spoke too soon, but Mario will barely make his way over the finish line. I don't know where all the speed's going. I mean, this is the this is the downhill section. Uh, maybe the replay will hold some answers, but Mario did not end up on the rail. He just he went look, he's going down the hill. Oh, he's spinning. Look at that. Backwards, back to forwards in a second here. I'm assuming. I mean, yeah, he just kind of pinballed down there. Back and forth, hitting two unmoving flippers, you could call it, and all the speed went away. He had a chance to beat Donkey Kong, but right now Donkey Kong has uh, three fives. And this is a hard one to individual sweep on, because we've seen many vehicles uh, be in first place, not have any problems with the trap door, and just completely get caught up on flat ground. I mean, I don't know how it happens, but it happens in this tournament so often. Donkey Kong way ahead once again. Mario on the far side to battle with him. Cappy and Yoshi pushing ahead as well. Which one of them all will advance up to all, uh, any of them still. Donkey Kong's gonna push out another five, but who will follow him? Looks like Mario has the points right now if all three of them continue to be as DNF'd as they are. It looks like they're gonna be DNF'd. I mean, three trap doors. Three of vehicles in the goo, one of them really bothering an unsuspecting cheap cheap. I mean, just not the place to swim today, honestly. Wow, he got hit hard. And Donkey Kong will finish up. 
20 points for Donkey Kong. That is not likely. That is not seen often. In, well, not seen ever, actually, I think, in this particular race. I think someone individually sweeped the finals in, like, video two or three, if I remember correctly. But uh, no one with the opportunity that Donkey Kong has right now. Now we have the next set of four. We have Yoshi, bob on Baby Peach, and Topper. Topper the rabbit there from Super Mario Odyssey, if you remember. Um, not a difficult boss to fight, but uh, certainly a fun one. Yoshi, near side, with some speed. Peach holding pace with him, now in front. Topper as well, and he's gonna get away. The only one to break away and not be good here. And across the finish line, somehow he will be the five. bob -um gets stuck right at the top there, through the transition. Not trapdoored, just trapped. And he'll roll back right onto the, the closed door. I don't know how, uh... Peach and Yoshi were the ones to fall here. They were both in the lead. Look at that. But Yoshi just flipped over, I think, the notch in the transition, lost all footing, and then somehow Peach did not trip the trap door for Topper. I mean, it just didn't happen. The mechanisms are too inconsistent. The Discord server, by the way, still open, still welcoming new members. We want to build that community. Long it may take as we... Um, haven't really done a Discord server up until now, but we're excited to have been able to start the venture. Please do join. Link will be in the description. With that, don't forget to subscribe and uh, check out the Diecast Racing TV channel as well. All that available for extra content and extra ways to be involved with races and fun. On the near side, Peach now on the far side. Topper with speed this time. Yoshi slowly catching up. Topper loses all footing. Trap door for both of them. They're both in the goo. And Peach will break away. He almost got out of it as he was trapdoored right at the edge. I think almost his back wheels, uh, only his back wheels got caught, but he was sent down. bob -um, slowest of them all, had no chance. Look at him, yeah, he got some air time there through the, the flipping of the door. Baby Peach, five points as well. E3. And it's a toss-up right now. It really is a uh, uncertain race. A lot of even speeds and uh, skill levels here. Topper, an early lead once again. Even with his arms flayed out like that, managed to get a ton of speed. Baby Peep taking it back over as she fights, and she'll be on the inner line here. She takes to the outer turn, and she'll lose all oh, out in the last place from first. bob -omb big lead, goes over, drops. No, Yoshi won't be dropped in. He'll just be stuck. Topper, I think, following for three points. And bob -omb will come across, and, well, it's swung back the other way now. I think Yoshi's the only one with no points to his name. He'll be stuck there. Not trap door, only trapped. Goo below. Door opens up and swallows Baby Peach. And I didn't think bob -um had it in him to take first place. I really was not expecting a lot. Oh, we almost got a... <laughs> Almost got a tic-tac-toe going in the scoreboard there. If we could put a five in Yoshi's place, we'll get, uh, we'll get a nice four in a row diagonal. <laughs> Listen, that is, that is mildly exciting to me, if I'm honest. Let's go for the tic-tac-toe. Come on, Yoshi, speed up there on the near side. He's got an inside line in the turn coming up here, so a chance to break away against Topper, though. He's going to need speed. He breaks out with not enough speed. Topper into the green first. He's going to flip the trap door. Yoshi will not head into it, though. Trap door did not flip. Topper is spinning, but Yoshi is stuck on the side and still no points. And the uh, four-in-a-row tic-tac-toe will not be completed, but if, if you stick to the three-by-three three rules, we have completed... So that's a beautiful diagonal of fives. One for the record books, I guess. And then bob -omb flips over there to the door, and same along with Baby Peach. I mean, Topper there had no control down the back straight, but it was really Yoshi who just, he just couldn't get himself uh, out of the, the rail, which is just the biggest problem. I'd rather spin a million times than be stuck on the rail. We got a tiebreaker, though. Five and five, Baby Peach for bob -omb. Baby Peach 
will be in the near side now, Babam as well. This time they opted to put them both on the same track, so they're gonna have trouble when they hit that green section. Babam to the near side as he takes the wide turn, Baby Peach gaining back a length, maybe two, maybe even, and Babam is dropped into the goo. Peach just stops. <laughs> uh, I don't know how we rule this. I I don't. I I guess we do another one. Babam had a lead. I mean, we're gonna show the replay, but I mean, I, what do we do here? We do it again. That's that's the only option. Bob on near side, Peach far side. They have uh, very wisely opted not to put them on the same track this time, so they can't interfere with each other's racing. Peach near side up by a few lengths. Bob on needs to catch up here, but has a longer turn to deal with. But speed here into the third straight. Peach up by only a length or two. They will both get through it. Bob on much slower, and I think that's it for him. Will he even cross? Yes, he will. So some posterity there but that's all he's got I mean there it, it's just a struggle and you can see how much the the notches or whatever trips those trap doors that the cars have to hit can be a problem even for the the safe vehicles the ones who don't fall into the goo it can just impede the racing so much and that happens a lot and speed is lost so often that happened to Bob on there. Obviously not enough practice with traversing that section, even though he's a fast racer and had the potential to move on. But that was in Baby Peach at the end with Mario Topper and of course Donkey Kong who has yet to lose today. Donkey Kong with some speed again. Mario trying to end that reign of Donkey Kong. Will he do it? Maybe he's only down a couple lengths. Maybe even just one here. Donkey Kong's so fast down the hill and Mario is nowhere to be seen. Topper will grab three points. Keep himself in the game here. And we'll start with 5-3 and a double zero. Mario and uh, Baby Peach together in the goo. The more you win, the more you goo. I mean, really, that's, that's, uh, that's what ends up happening further you advance in this competition, you just have to eat more goo. Heat 2. Near side Baby Peach, who will go up against Donkey Kong Topper and Mario on the far side diverse. Donkey Kong again, just out of the gate. Unbelievable speed. He's got five once again. He's working on a six win. Mario is trying to cut down on it. He's been a lot faster this time. Now only two lengths behind, maybe even three at this point. They come across, they're close. Donkey Kong spins, Mario nose hits. And instead of blocking in front, he knocks him forward. Topper will also finish and keep himself again in the game with now five points. Mario needed to zag to the outside instead of zigging to the inside. Donkey Kong had and uh, left an opportunity open for Mario. And Mario said, no thanks. Baby Peach falls into the goo. And, uh, well, Donkey Kong is only two away from an individual sweep in one of the harder tournaments to individually sweep, I'll say for sure. Keep an eye on Donkey Kong. Lane three, up against Topper this time. Mario still looking to get at least one win just to make him avoid the sweep. Some old friends, but also some old rivals in those two, and he would love nothing more than to end that possibility. Donkey Kong, big lead right here. Will he stay straight and stay strong in this uh, transition? He will. Somehow, looks like the wheels bounce, but he's out of it. Topper not fast enough. Donkey Kong now with three fives in the finals. Peach stuck there at the end. Pipe frame tangled in the rails. And I think Mario didn't finish. A lot of goo for him today. I, I think with this win from Donkey Kong, I don't know if any other car can win, but we're fortunate enough to have an individual sweep opportunity, so it's still quite interesting going down to this last race. Though Top, is Topper still in this? I mean, no, I think he's out of it. Yeah, he's not, no chance. Eight points, you can't get more than seven, more than six points in a, well, you can't get more than five, but he can't get seven is what I'm saying. So he's got no chance. Donkey Kong has secured the win, but can he secure the individual sweep on the far side against Peach? Mario and Topper with some speed this time. Topper even with the lead momentarily. Donkey Kong grabs it right back though. Two lengths, three lengths, maybe even four on the inside line with the turn. Five, six, 
through the transition, doesn't drop at all, doesn't get hurt at all, a little bit of speed lost, but he's across and that's individually a full sweep in this tournament. Well, at least in this group, but what a way to finish the day. Topper came close with eight points, but nothing speaks to 20. Mario finally makes his way to the end with Baby Peach, but that's not gonna be nearly enough once again. That will wrap this one up. Donkey Kong filling out that sixth spot and probably the most uh, <laughs> frightening of the finals racers with an absolutely dominant performance, even more than the pipe in the sports coupe. Two more spots to fill. What a way to individually sweep. Do not forget to subscribe. We'll see you next time on the channel.